On tap tonight, NBA playoff action continues. It's game two of the Western Conference semifinals. I'm Kevin Harlan. Mark Kellogg and Mike Fratello are with me at the table. And on the sidelines tonight, David Aldridge. Clippers off the tip. Here's Nixon. Here's Cummings. Up and in on the way. Take it right to the defense. Not a bad way to start this game. And here are the Jazz now. They need to bounce back from Wednesday's loss. 13 feet away. And good. Got the English that time as it falls. So many different tricks up his sleeve. Makes him a tough matchup. Outside Pierce. And the pass to Cummings. His second shot goes in. Off to a good start. Two for two. A red hot beginning to this game. Well, he's a real good offensive player. So they want to get him going early. Outside Maravich. And it's good. Two points. Just straight tricking the defender with the shot fake. This is how it's done. That was the 2K drop. As that move deserved another look. Aggressive take there to get inside. Looking to make things happen to try and take control of this game. Here's Nixon. Here's Cummings. Plays it up off the glass. Cummings got six. Boy, how about the confidence? I love watching him be that assertive down low. And pin the blame on the defense there. You can't just give him an open layup. Three. Cummings grabs the board. San Diego, they've gotten their first three shots to go in for him to start off this game. Here's Nixon. Pass to Donaldson. Good for the basket. Starting off one for one with that shot. You got to know the scouting report on this guy. I mean, you cannot allow him to establish position in there. Yeah, and if you do, you're going to have to show more fight than that. Lackluster effort there. Clippers have gone four of four to start. So a nice offensive rhythm to start here. Cummings can't hit. He's a solid mid-range shooter, but just wasn't able to knock that one down. Pass to Green. First quarter of ball, almost two and a half minutes in. Doesn't get it to drop for him. So the Clippers will take it the other way. Here's the pass to Nixon. Walton is screen on green. And it's Nixon missing. Got the look he wanted. Sometimes it just doesn't go down. Coach, a tough stretch for this offense. I'd say they need to get back to what they do best. Right now, that's a question mark. A big question mark. Here's the pass to Cummings. And the jam by Terry Cummings. Launching right to the rim, flying through the air. Terry Cummings throwing it down. And the Jazz call time here. Without question, Terry Cummings displaying his skills today. Just really a one-man wrecking crew down low. He's pretty much dictated the pace with the steady offense inside. And the timeout right now, probably going to be making some adjustments.
Bailey passes to Green. Nice ball movement by Utah. Pass to Eaton. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. When Eaton is aggressively looking to score, he's hard to challenge without fouling. Let's quickly check out the scoring breakdown here for San Diego. Shooting two. First free throw is good. And you know, Eden at seven foot four, this guy typically overpowers defenses with his size. He's a, an excellent shot blocker and also rebounds pretty well. And so he hits both. First quarter of action, just under three and a half minutes played. Outside, Pierce. Walton, the pass to Cummings. Here's Nixon. He's still scoreless so far in this one. He hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance points. Great job of crashing the offensive glass. He stayed with it. That's hard-nosed, tough basketball. Green, the pass to Dantley. Here's Eaton on the wing. Green to the left wing. Here's Dentley. Another miss by Utah. San Diego leading by six. Here's Nixon. Here's Pierce. That one no good. Good work defensively by Maravich. The pass to Bailey. Back to Mirovich. On deep. The Jazz again can't hit it. Boy, they dodged one right there, didn't they? Yeah, he won't miss a look that wide open very often. Here's Nixon. Pass to Cummings. The Clippers need to get off a shot. Here's Dantley. Alton defending. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. Inside, Dantley can be a real troublemaker. He goes straight for the defense and gets himself fouled. The Jazz have had two chances at the line already, making them both. First one falls for him. Great score. Dantley could light it up. Both good from the line that time making it look effortless. Send this guy to the strike. He's going to cash in more than not. Here's Nixon. No points in the game yet for him. Here's Cummings. From down in the low post, it goes. Excellent vision on display. Dropping a dime to set up his teammate. Out to the wing. Here's Dentley. And Walton sends it back. What a play by Walton. A difference maker on the defensive end. Here's Cummings. Pass to Nixon. Maravich against Pierce. Passes it to Cummings. Just five to shoot. Launches it. They get it back. And Walton throws it down. That is one of the many things you get from Walton. 
He's a relentless rebounder. Utah trails by eight. Now Green. There's the pass to Eaton. Here's Dentley. Right side Green. Kicks to Maravich. Fires the three. It's rebounded by Donaldson. Donaldson's got five rebounds tonight. Here's Pierce. And he can't extend the lead to double digits. Utah has gone 0 of 2 from deep here. Here's Green. Here's Bailey. And terrific work on the offensive glass, and he picks up two. You know, I think when you give up second chance points, a lot of it comes down to simply a lack of effort. Yeah, it's simple. A key part of playing good defense is limiting the offense to one shot. And that starts with boxing out. Timeout called by the San Diego Clippers. And San Diego making a change here. Morgan's checked in. Here's Nixon. He's been quiet so far. Still no points in the game. Donald's in the pass to Nixon. Now here's Pierce. Lock at six. Shoots over Maravich. Offensive rebound. Right wing. Second chance shot. Couldn't get it to drop. He's now made five of eight shots. Mike, they are desperate to find a basket. Mm, they're having a really hard time out there. You're right. One of the game's better finishers, Dantley can also make plays for others. Clippers leading by four. Here's the pass to Morton. Cummings in the post. It's stolen by Green. Here's Bailey. Good as Green picking up the assist. Bailey's got his second bucket of the night. A sharp steal and some quick offense cuts it down to a one-possession game. Well done. Nixon, the pass to Cummings. Fires from 14. It's blocked. They retain possession. Outside, Pierce. A fadeaway. And that one hits back iron. Utah's gone 0 of 2 from deep here. Bantley the pass to Green. That evens the score. Green's got six. This is how unselfish Stantley is. Ready and willing to feed his teammates. Outside Pierce. It's stolen by Green.
goes to the reverse layup and pops it in. He's got eight. And a chance now to catch up on some numbers here. The hustle stats for the Utah Jazz. And the Clippers decide to take their first time out here. Boy, they've been staggered right now. Really? So good idea to use the T.O. A chance to refocus your team. Try to respond with your own run, perhaps. up going with the new group. McKinney. It's stolen. And here we go. Here's Drew. Here's Kelly. And he banks in the lane. And the Jazz lead by four. It's never easy trying to keep him off the glass. He's an absolute beast down there. McKinney passes to Morgan. They set the pick. Benson, no good. And they can't put him into this drought. Jazz leading by four. Here's Giles. It's Porter atop the key. Here's Drew. Shot clock at six. Porter kicks to Giles. Beats the shot clock but can't get it to fall. San Diego trails by four. Here's McKinney. He's gotten some minutes, but nothing on the board yet. Shifty move. Nice D from Porter. Utah has gone 0 of 2 from deep here. Here's Drew. It's hauled in by the Clippers. Well, he's much better than that. Really no excuse for missing that lane. Forty-four left to play in the first. Here's McKinney. That's in, and he found his range with that one. Now one for two. One thirty-five left to play in the first quarter. Here's Giles. It's not going to go for him, and the Clippers will go the other way with it. Here's Kelly, and he converts the layup. Kelly's got his second bucket of the game to go. The story of their offense so far has been just that, getting a number of looks from point-blank range. Here's McKinney. Just five on the clock. Here's Decker. It's rebounded by Kelly. Jazz leading by four. Here's Griffith. Pass to Giles. 
outside Porter. Here's Griffith. Off on the layup. Shot clock and game clock separated by less than six seconds. Hunter, it's good. He makes his first shot of the game. We've got 22 seconds left here in the first quarter. Here's Giles. No points in the game yet for him. Here's Drew. And that shot was up in time, but doesn't go in. And still a close game as the first quarter comes to a close. Jazz leads by two. And we'll get the second quarter underway on the other side of this break. And we return again with more playoff action from the Western Conference semifinals. And the guys, what's your take on Utah so far? That first quarter looked like a track meet for him. Lots of fun and in running. It's kind of like one of my practices. Either way, great job in transition. And the Jazz with possession. Here's Griffin. Here's Eaton. He's guarded by Hodges. The shot's good from Eaton. Eaton able to go straight through that interior defense to get the score, holding nothing back. Here's McKinney. Finds himself wide open and drills it. McKinney's got his second basket of the night. And if you give him space like that in the mid-range, he won't hesitate to let it fly. And there's the try. Pass to Griffith. Here's Heaton. And the rebound paying off as they pick up two on the second chance bucket right there. Getting aggressive and creating a second chance opportunity. Exactly what coaches want to see. Passes it to Donaldson. And here is Cummings. Jazz Jones. Both teams deciding to change it up. First team foul. Substitution on the court. play just over a minute of basketball here in the second quarter here's Cummings it's good and it's his sixth make against 11 attempts Cummings has so much in his game not to mention how strong and skilled he is he's capable of dominating because of it. here's he he's been quiet so far still no points in the game from 13 a shot by Dentley, no good. San Diego shooting here, about 46% for the game. Hodges the pass to McKinney. Now here's Cummings. Tight defense on him. Offensive rebound. Goes back up. The pass to Hodges. Out to the right wing. Here's McKinney. It's good. This game is all even. McKinney's got his third bucket of the night. The Jazz have gone two of five from the field here in the second quarter, shooting 40%. Pass two Eves. Here's Eaton. Shot from 12. Nice jump shot. Good. Eaton's got eight points. With him, the scouting report says you've got to go over the screen. Absolutely. He'll hurt you from deep. So you have to fight through those picks. Now here's Cummings. 12 points for him. Count the basket. Cummings got it all tied up now for San Diego. I bet Coach loves to see this. Attacking the interior for a safer shot. Here's Griffith. Here's Heaton. And it's the Clippers with the rebound. Cummings got four rebounds now tonight. Hodges misses. For Utah, they've gone 3-7 shooting the ball here in the second quarter. Here's Griffith. Got a piece of it. 
and he's able to get it back. Bailey. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. That one on coming. He's getting his first free throw attempt of the night right now. And the first one drops. That one falls, so he hits both of them. San Diego, they've gone four of six in the field here in the second. And a little under three and a half minutes elapsed in the second quarter of play. Here's Pierce. Steps back and drains the jump shot. You know, even if they anticipated the step back coming, the defense didn't offer a ton of resistance. Outside, Maravich. To the wing right side. Here's Dantley. He's guarded by Cummings. And too much time in the lane. They get called for the three-second violation. The Clippers have gone 5 of 7 from the field here in the second. Here's Nixon. Still getting warmed up offensively. No scoring yet from him. Here's Pierce. And no good. Had a chance to take the lead there. Utah shooting 38% in the second quarter. Offensively, they look a little bit confused. I think that's on the defense there. I mean, you just can't let him bully you inside like that. you got to hold your ground. Yeah, that kind of effort will get you benched. You have to show more energy and a willingness to stop him down low. Utah. Check in for San Diego. Second two. Down to the line of the Clippers. Bill Walton. Outside, Pierce. Pass to Nixon. And here is Cummings. He's got 14, and the basket is good. Hey, this is a rinse and repeat, just like last game. He's had his fingerprints all over this one, looking totally dominant. He realizes his strengths on offense and does a fantastic job playing to them and finding ways to stay hot. Here's Dantley. San Diego getting their last shot to go in. Rebound, Bill Walton. Walton's got his fourth rebound in this one. Nixon, the pass to Pierce. And it's blocked. Out of bounds, Clippers ball as the Clippers keep possession. And that kind of stifling effort on defense needs another look. It's a different kind of defense teams play in the postseason. Much more intense, more in your face. High energy plays like that one are winning plays. Eight away. Count that one. And the Clippers lead by two. I'm not so sure he needed it, but the fadeaway does make the shot even sweeter. Giles, the pass to Eaton. Outside, Maravich. For the three. And that's collected by Bill Walton. Sometimes you do things right on offense, and the shots just don't fall. Pierce's shot is good. Assistant. The Jazz shooting a meager 37% for the game. Offensively, Clark, things have sort of fallen apart for them. And they need to recover as soon as possible. Bailey passes to Giles. Nice ball movement by Utah. 
Here's Heaton. Great D that time from Walton. Clippers leading by four. Here's Potter with the drive. Misses from close range. The Jazz shooting 33% in the second quarter. The offense has looked crossed up and confused at times. Bantley the pass to Giles. Down to five on the shot clock. And Walton sends it back. And it's out of bounds. The Jazz able to retain possession here. And a first time out of the game called for Utah. And with their offense sputtering, time to talk things over. Yeah, they've got to get organized and make more of their opportunities. He's checked in for Utah. Benson, he's checked in for the Clippers. Just four to shoot. Green inside the three-point line. The Jazz with another miss. San Diego leading by four. Pass to Nixon. Pierce with the screen on green. Here's Potter. Wants to get it to Pierce and does. Down it goes. That's four made from the field. He's four of eight. And the defense no factor, which is why he simply laid it in. Right side green. A pass to Bailey. Pass to Dantley. To halt the run. Shooting foul. As the whistle blows, he'll shoot two free throws. So active on the offensive end. Dantley really earns these trips to the line. The Jazz have been perfect so far from the free throw line. Six for six. And the first one at the line is good. The Jazz making a switch here. Kelly's checked in. And San Diego also making a switch. Decker's checked in for Pierce. Good on both. Here's Nixon. Still looking for his first bucket in this one. He dishes it to Walton. 
tries from seven. And that one goes long. Utah trails by four. On the top of the key. And good that time. Paravich has got four this quarter. You know, he can beat you a lot of ways. Actually, any kind of way. The quick jumper. His agility on the move is excellent. Maravich always making things happen. And it goes out of bounds. Last touch by Green. And Utah making a change here. to Nixon. Here's Potter. Shot clock at five. Passes it to Walt. The offensive rebound. Decker gets the bucket. And the Clippers lead by four. Close range, high percentage looks will never go out of style. That's just strong, fundamental basketball. There's a screen. Here's Drew. Here's Kelly. Score it. His third straight basket in three tries. San Diego shooting 59% here in the second quarter. They're playing with great confidence. To the right side. Here's Nixon. Guarded by Green. Walt. And that one's good. His second basket of four, shooting 50%. The defense is at Walton's mercy inside, able to score in a multitude of ways down there. Green with the ball. Eight points for him. Here's Porter. Off target with the fadeaway. Unnecessary to go to the fadeaway there. It wasn't needed. Could have just kept it simple and taken the easy shot. Good ball movement here by the Clippers. Here's Nixon. He's still scoreless so far in this one. Puts one up from 19. Misses off the left eye. Utah trails by four. Here's Drew. There's a screen by Porter. And he's knocked off course by the D. The foul call. He'll shoot free throws. No matter what the scenario, Drew finds a way to get things done. It's his first trip to the line. The first one drops. That's also good. So he hits both free throws. And here are the Clippers now. Benson, guarded by Green. Here is Hodges. He's been patient so far. Nothing on the scoreboard yet. Four on the clock. Here's McDowell. Banked in off the glass. Craig Hodges is more than just a shooter, folks. He knows how to get the ball to his open teammates. Green passes to Griffin. Back to Green. And there's a minute 45 left in the first half. Now the pass to Kelly. So the wing on the left. Fires the three. It's hauled in by San Diego. You know, he's taking shot after shot after shot, but still can't break out of this cold streak. At this point, it's all mental. He's in his own head, not letting the shots come naturally. Smooth reverse. He knew just what he was doing there. 114 left now here in the second. Griffin. 
And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. And, you know, Griffith is a lights-out scorer now. I mean, a guy who can take over games. Love his confidence. For Utah, they haven't made a mistake at the line yet. Ten of ten. The first one fall. Donnie's checked in for Hanson. And a switch here also for the Clippers. McKinney's checked in. And that's good as he hits both of his shots. Here is Hodges. Nothing yet on the scoreboard for him. Pass to Decker. Six on the shot clock. Here's McKinney. No good. Now the Jazz take it the other way. To the paint, here's Green, and right on through for another basket. He's got five made on five of nine shooting. Great vision by Drew. Saw a teammate with a great look. Found him. Here's McKinney. He has six. Over Green. And it's going to be out of bounds. The Jazz will take it. The ball sailing out of bounds. That's the <laughs> offensive possession they were hoping for. Donaldson, he's checked in for Robertson. And here's Don. He'll bring it up for Utah. Trailing by two. Over to the wing. Cuts it fly. Drew misses. Boy, that's a squandered opportunity there. One he'd like to have back for sure. Here's McKinney. And they recover it. The second chance effort. No good on that one. And that's it for the first half of action. What's been a very close game here. The Clippers on top. They lead by a bucket. And we'll be back for the second half following the break. Keep it right here on 2K Sports. And glad to have you with us as we get going here in game two. It's been one outstanding game from Terry Cummings. This is a big game, and he's risen to the occasion so far. Playing with a lot of grit and determination. Yeah, giving Coach everything he could ask for. Not allowing the pressure of this contest to affect his game. And we're halfway through this one. Plenty of basketball left in a game that's been fairly even so far. Outside, Green. Pass to Eaton. Here's Dantley. He's guarded by Cummings. Dantley the pass to Bailey. That ties the game. Bailey's got it going here in the start of the second half. The first points in the third quarter for the Jams. Now San Diego with it. Here's Nixon. No points in the game yet for him. Poked away. Here's Walton. Utah with the rebound. Now here's Green. Right side, Maravich. That puts them in the lead. Maravich has got eight points. This speaks to his high basketball IQ. Assessing the situation perfectly and kicking it out. Here's Cummings. Uses the glass to finish the layup. Cummings got the game tied up here for the Clippers. Here's Green. It's Maravich on the wing. Passes to Dantley. A jump hook, and there's another one for the Jams. You look at Dantley, he's six foot five. You expect him to be a jump shooter, but Adrian rather take it down low. Nixon, the pass to Cummings. Good ball movement here by the Clippers. 
the pass to Pierce. Six to shoot. Rebounded by Bailey. Bailey's got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. Jazz have gone three of three from the field since halftime. Here's Maravich. It's hauled in by San Diego. Walton's got rebound number eight here tonight in the game. Cummings passes to Nixon. Out to the right wing. Fires from 18. Cummings shot is good. Cummings got 20 points. Ricky can't be thrown any better. That bounce pass hit him right in stride. Outside green. Pass to Maravich. A touch over two and a half minutes of basketball played here in the third quarter. Here's Green. Rebound, Bill Walton. Walton's got nine rebounds in the game. Getting it done. Throws it up high. Here's Dantley. He's got six. Maravich, good. Maravich has got ten points in the game. That's an excellent move inside. Keeping pace here. I'm glad we got a chance to check out that fantastic drive one more time. And a close game, you got to find the edge. High energy plays like that one can make a big difference. Here's Cummings. They get it back. Walt and contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. A gigantic guy. I love when Walton uses his size to attract attention inside. The Clippers shooting their first free throws of the evening. Shooting two. First one falls for him. You know, one of the most complete bigs in the game. Walton can do everything for you at both ends of the floor. And he makes the first, but misses the second. Jazz have gone four or six from the field since the start of the third. Here's Maravich. That one off the back iron and out. Clippers have gone two or seven from the field in the third. That leaves room for improvements. Here. And it's Nixon missing. Utah leading. From the baseline. It's rebounded by Donaldson. Donaldson's got double-digit rebounds now in the game. For the lead. The shot by Pierce will not go. The Jazz shooting it well here in the third, about 50%. Takes it inside. It's deflected, and they'll keep possession. Green dishes to Maravich. The Clippers grab the miss. Donaldson's got the glass covered here tonight. 11 boards for him. Utah. And San Diego calls time here. A chance here for the players to get a much-needed break, catch their breath, and for the coach to make some adjustments. Yeah, he saw something out there that he wants to change. We'll see how it plays out on the floor. And San Diego making a change here. Morgan's checked in. Yeah. 
And here are the Clippers now. Back to Cummings. Here's Nixon, headed by Green. And the Clippers miss again. For Utah, they've gone a somewhat so far 4 of 10 on their shots in the second half so far. Bentley the pass to Eaton. Terrific assist, a nice finish. Solid play all around. This is what a floor general looks like. The vision and the pinpoint pass. Pass to Pierce. Over Maravich. The shot by Pierce will not go. Jazz leading by three. Green left side. Let's it go from 14. Here's Eaton. That's good. Basket number five on a five for eight night shooting. Mark Eaton is so big. 7'4", well over 300 pounds. He gives everybody in the league issues. And tonight, he's having his weight. Now here's coming. 20 points for him. And out of bounds as Utah gains possession. Let's take a second look at that fantastic block. Well, you got to take your defense up a notch in the playoffs. He takes it up about three notches on this block. For the Jams. Hansen comes in for Maravich. And Giles is subbed in for Green. And then for San Diego, Robertson comes in for Walton. And it's Benson in for Pierce. Here's Giles. Still getting warmed up offensively. No scoring hit from him. Passes it to Baylor. Lock at six. Here's Tintley. And he could not get that one to go. A lot of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. Sly move by Bentley, using the pump fake to get his defender off balance and get the whistle. And an important part of every team's game, a look at the hustle stats for the Jazz. Shoot two. First free throw is good. And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. San Diego trails by seven. Here's Nixon. He's still scoreless so far in this one. Here's coming. Oh, oh look oh, out! Oh. Look out! Mm. Looks like he's trying to fire up the troops a little with that one. Yeah, stylish slam. You're right. Uh, Clark could help get their mojo going. No better time for that to happen than right now. So it's the Jazz now. The Clippers getting the bucket. Second team foul. Substitution for the Clippers. Potter. Billy McKinney. Here's Bailey. He's got eight. The pass to Giles. Five to shoot. The Jazz need to get off a shot here. Hansen can hit. San Diego trails by five. Here's McKinney. He has six. Benson, the pass to Morgan. Good ball movement here by the Clippers. Here's Potter. Let's it go from the wing. That misses off the back. Plenty of space. Good work there as it goes. Dantley's got the lead up to seven now for the Jams. A go-to shot for Dantley. His mid-range J is just money in the bank. They want to break this scoring drought, Mike. They've had a lid over the basket for a while now. Indeed. McKinney, no good. Utah leading by seven. Bailey passes to Giant. Here's Hanson. 
Here's Heaton. And Utah again with the bucket. For his size, he is an elite shooter. And he'll beat you for multiple spots on the floor, including the mid-range. Goes up to the stripe. McKinney, no good. He's just forcing too many shots out there right now. Just needs to dial it back and look to work the ball around the floor to his teammates. Here's Bailey. They lead by their biggest margin of the game. No. This is his second trip to the line in this one. First free throw is good. Both teams will make substitutions. Both shots good from the strike. Diego trails by 11. Here's McKinney. Six points for him. Over Giles. Shots good by McKinney. McKinney's got eight points. Jazz have gone 8 of 16 in the third quarter to put their second half shooting percentage right at 50%. Giles, the pass to Drew. Here's Kelly. He's got six. Pass to Giles. Six on the shot clock. Here's Bailey, and he uses the glass on the way. Bailey's got six points in the quarter. Found the crease, took advantage, and got it in close. An edge to this lead. They're having their way. Here's McKinney. Eight points for him. Here's Benson. It's rebounded by Kelly. Kelly's got his second rebound here tonight. Here's Drew. Offensive rebound. And there's the second dunk to finish it off. Hey, it's as plain as this. Drew is an extremely hard worker. That's how he gets himself these second chance looks. Here's McKinney. Pass to Morgan. Here's McKinney. Pass to Potter. Shoots a three. Decker passes to Morgan. Knocked away. And the pass to Benson. And that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle and two shots coming up. San Diego shooting their third and fourth free throw shots of the night. Makes the first. So both teams changing it up here. Both good from the line that time. Utah leading by 11. Here's Griffith. Tries it from 19. Another shot. And the layup is good. Kelly's got eight points. Getting rewarded for all his work down low. And that's what they want from him. If he goes unchecked on the glass, they'll end up with a lead like this more often than not. Here's McDowell. Here's Hodges. The rebound by Drew. I seriously doubt that was the shot that they were looking for right there. And the defense wants those type of shots. He played right into it. 
here's Eves. Still looking for his first bucket in this one. Griffith passes to Kelly. Out of bounds. San Diego takes possession. Donaldson, he's jacked in for San Diego. And the Clippers have possession. It's a 13-point game. McKinney passes to McDowell. Here's Donaldson. One nineteen left in the third quarter. Pass to Hodges. Tries from 16. It's tipped. Here's E. Dishes it to Kelly. Pass to Griffin. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. Personal foul. These are his third and fourth free throw attempts of the game. He misses the free throw. He hits the second from the line. San Diego trails by 14. There's 53 seconds left in the third quarter of the game. Here is Hodges. He's gotten some minutes, but nothing on the board yet. Can't hit from in close. Here's E. He's guarded by Hodges. Just his first attempt. Shots good by E. And the Jazz lead by 16. San Diego shooting 38% from the field. A pretty neat showing for them. Here's McKinney. Eight points for him. There's the lob to the hoop. Stolen away. Nice job to interrupt the alley-oop attempt there. Here's E. From past the arc. And he got that one up in time, but doesn't go in. And so it's Utah. With a sizable lead as the quarter wraps up, they're ahead 16 points. And their ability to get points in the paint has made all the difference in this one. We'll return shortly. And there have been two very different performances from these teams today. So we get going in quarter number four. There's the drive. Here's McKinney. Now Cummings. Six to shoot. Here's the pass to Donaldson. Tries again. And the call on the shot. It sends him to the line. You know, he goes about seven feet tall. Bill Walton is a nightmare matchup, not just because of his height, but because of his skill, too. Plus, he has a really high IQ. Shoot two. And he knocks down the first one. So Walton nails both of them. And here's Green. He'll bring it up for Utah. Feeds it to Maravich. 
good and it's green picking up the assist looking to stretch this lead out even further going right after his shot and the defense continues to not be up to the challenge here's against Maravich who's back up and the basket by Walton Walton's got four points in the quarter good recognition you have the mismatch go to work Green taking his time here. Passes it to Bailey. Here's Griffith. He's guarded by Cummings. Shot clock at six. Here's Griffith. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. That one on Cummings. And he makes the first. That's also good. So he hits both free throws. San Diego trails by 16. Nixon, the pass to Donaldson. First minute and a half of basketball played here in the fourth quarter. And here is Cummings. Gets it to go from 18 feet away. Cummings got 24 points. I think he's got to show more fight than that. Can't give up on the play once you get screened. You got to continue to fight through. And coach is definitely going to be frustrated with that effort. Or lack of one, that is. And we're around two minutes into the fourth quarter here. Bailey passes to Green. The feed to Maravich. Poke loose. Goes up again. Great D that time from Walton. San Diego trails by 14. Cummings passes to Nixon. Here's Pierce. San Diego moving the ball around. Here's Donaldson. Chalk up two there. And with how effective he's been offensively, you'd like to see him be more aggressive. He needs to keep shooting if they want to cut into this lead. And the Jazz call time here. It's now time to take a look at our player of the game. Well, you know, it's easy to understand why he's the choice given how well he shot the ball. I mean, just shooting an insane percentage really is what led him to this award. And it's because he was also actively looking to score. He was hunting his shots and was knocking them down. 
Falling into a two-game hole would have been a disaster, and he knew it. He's done everything in his power to get momentum back on their side in this series. While we've got a moment, let's send it over to our terrific reporter, David Aldridge. David? Well, guys, during the last break, I listened to Utah's coach address his team. He talked about the mindset they need to have and what he wants to see the rest of the way. Engagement at both ends and making good decisions with the ball. Guys? Thank you, David. For those just joining us, fourth quarter here, we're just over two and a half minutes into it. Maravich kicks to Green. They set the pick. And there's the pass to Eaton. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. And an easy call for the officials there. Yeah, don't argue that whistle. Pretty obvious. And the first one at the line is good. He's off on the second. San Diego trails by 13. Here's Nixon, and that basket's going to count, folks. Gets the goaltending call right there. Yeah, he was just a skosh late on the contest. That's going to be a goaltend for sure. We're in the final quarter of play here, three minutes in. Green passes to Eaton. Outside, Maravich. The Jazz again can't hit it. This is what happens to streaky shooters. He couldn't miss in the first half, and now he can't buy one. Here's Nixon, guarded by Green. Here's Cummings. Offensive rebound. Controls the rebound and puts it back up and in. He is truly one of the outstanding offensive rebounders in the game. Terry Cummings, excellent at reading where shots are coming off and then pursuing the pump. Here's Eaton. Here's Dantley. And oh boy, a lot of contact there, but he gets the call and will shoot two. Is that one on Cummings? First free throw is good. second so he makes them both San Diego trails by 11 here's Nixon and wrestling for it there but no one has possession we'll have a jump ball Walton the pass to Donaldson pass to Nixon Six to shoot, and count it from 19 feet away. Nixon's got four points now in the quarter. Utah leading by nine. 
for three. Maravich. It's hauled in by San Diego. Cummings got six rebounds now in the game. Pass to Nixon. Back to Cummings. Walton with the ball. Passes it to Nixon. Five on the clock. Back to Walton. He read his eyes on that steal. Saw where he wanted to go with it and jumped the lane. Green the pass to Maravich. Here's Bailey. Walton defending. Bailey misses. San Diego trails by nine. Now here's Cummings. Some nice ball movement by the Clippers. It's Maravich on the wing. Fires from the wing. The shot, no good. So San Diego will take it the other way. Cummings dishes to Pierce. There's the pass to Nixon. Here's Donaldson. It's tipped. Al Maravich to the inside. Shots good by Dantley. Dantley's got four this quarter. Love seeing this kind of interior passing. This is how you break a defense down. And San Diego calls time here. There is no excuse for them to be giving the ball up as much as they have been. Hopefully, they can get on the same page during this timeout. Pass to Nixon. Cummings up on top. Pass to Nixon. Lock at six. Down low. Donaldson the pass to Cummings. It's blocked. And they force the shot clock violation. Great team. Maravich. Outside, Green. 
Here's Dantley. He's guarded by Cummings. Shots good by Dantley. And the Jazz lead by 13. Such a crafty scorer. Dantley excels at finishing through contact. This is it to Cummings. Drops in the layup for two. Cummings got 12 points here in the second half. Yeah, he's been hooping, but the rest of the team, not so much. The pass to Eaton. Maravich left side. Again, the Jazz score. Well, it's really hard to come back if you can't get stops. You've got to figure out a way to stop the bleeding if you're going to come back. And he looked very comfortable on that one. Not a lot of resistance. Now here's Pierce. And the jam by Terry Cummings. Absolutely loving what I'm seeing right there. Wow. A slam with an exclamation point. They're cutting into this lead. Here's against Maravich. Takes the three. They grab their own miss. Again, the Jazz score. Well, I love the focus we're seeing from him right now. Really taking advantage of chances to impact the game. And he did it in their last game, too. He is on a tear. Competing with every ounce of energy he's got. Here is Cummings. After the basket by Utah. Some nice ball movement by the Clippers. Six on the shot clock. Screen by Walton. Shoots from the high post. Nixon, the pass to Walton. Utah with the rebound. And that's a strong defensive effort to force the miss, especially against someone of his caliber. Right side, Maravich. Basket counts. Maravich has got six points in the quarter. Here's Nixon. Outside, Pierce. Pass to Cummings. Back to Pierce. He kicks it to Cummings. Here's Nixon. Pass to Walton. 16 feet away. Rebound, Utah. Eaton's got 15 rebounds here tonight. Inside, here's Bailey. Fouled on the shot and picks up two points. So one free throw coming up. Nice work, and they are getting it done at both ends. And building on this lead. They played a pretty complete game. In San Diego making a change here. Morgan's checked in. One shot. One shot. Diego trails by 18. They need to find a high percentage shot, Clark, to regain some of that confidence. I think they've gone too long without seeing one go down, and that begins to mess with your psyche. Now here's Cummings. Here's Nixon. To stop the run. Donaldson no good. And so Green will bring it up for Utah. 18 points separating the teams. That's the biggest lead of the game. Passes to Dantley. Good. Great play by Green to set it up. Green's got five assists in the game. Clippers shooting 44% in the fourth. The offense with some ups and downs. And the pass to Donaldson. He feeds it to Cummings. A jump hook. And it's in off the backboard. Cummings got 10 points now just in this quarter. So consistent from the field. A quality outing for him. Right wing. Eaton the pass to Green. Here's Dantley. Pass to Griffin. Here's Bailey. Terry Cummings grabs the rebound. Cummings got eight rebounds in this game. There's a minute 40 left in the game. Tries it from 19. They get it back. Here's Donaldson. 
No good there. You know, his scoring has just been a wall this quarter. I'm not sure what the issue is, but his team is doing what they can to try and get him going. Well, that's going to wrap this one up. Fans are already starting to flood the exits. This is going to go down as a big game to win for the Jazz. What do you think, Clark? The coaching staff has to be happy with the way they've limited their turnovers in this one. Well, I think it comes down to really good patience and self-control. And this win has really got to feel fantastic, guys. It evens up the series now at one game apiece. No good off the front iron. Utah has gone 0-3 so far in the fourth quarter from long range. Outside, green. 43 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Here's Tantley. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. This is a foul. 15 foul. At the line for your Jazz, Adrian Tantley. Two shots. Shooting two. First one falls for Walton check in for the Clippers. So after making the first, he goes one for two. Now San Diego with it. Here's Nixon. Rebounded by Bailey. 24 seconds left here in the fourth quarter. Green the pass to Dantley. Back to Green. Jazz passing it around. Shot from the wing. A shot by Dentley, no good. And so it's Utah easily grabbing the win. It's time for us to say goodbye, and we hope you've enjoyed our second round coverage of the NBA Western Conference Playoffs. Mark Kellogg, Mike Fratello, and David Aldridge, and the rest of our 2K team, this is Kevin Harlan signing off. So long. <laughs>